Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So just a quick video to give you a heads up that if you are running AMD software and are running an AMD GPU, that there are reports now that for some Windows 10 and Windows 11 users, they are finding that Microsoft is replacing their existing AMD GPU drivers with older versions, which is not a good thing because as many of you may know, if that happens, it could lead to different issues and a range of different problems. And this has actually been confirmed by AMD in a recent post, as we can see. And I thought just to give you a quick heads up in this video and uh, just um, go through what the actual problem is in case you are affected and some things and recommend recommendations you can try to fix the issue until an official fix is rolled out. Now, um, AMD describes the issue as follows. They say that um, you may encounter the following a warning when trying to launch AMD software on some Windows 10 and Windows 11 systems, including mobile and all-in-one platforms. So that's ARO for short. And AMD says that um, the AMD software will not launch after exiting the warning dialog box. So even if you exit this warning, that AMD software will still not launch, which as mentioned is not a good thing. Now the whole cause of this issue um, is that a Microsoft Windows Update has installed a universal Windows platform UWP driver for your AMD Radeon graphics um, product, which is not compatible with the current installed version of AMD software. So just to put this all into context, if we head over to the settings Windows Update, as many of you will know, uh, you can get driver updates um, through Windows Update as a, a quality update or in certain circumstances as an optional update. So what's happening here is that Windows Update is replacing um, your existing driver um, with a driver that is not compatible with the current installed version of AMD software and that's causing the whole issue. And what happens now is that since there are now two versions of AMD software installed on your system, um, you will encounter this warning as mentioned. So if we head back to that warning, you will encounter this warning when trying to launch um, the unsupported version of AMD software. So that's basically in a nutshell what is happening. Now, um, what you can do according to AMD to try and resolve this issue um, until a fix is rolled out, there are two recommendations. You can stop Windows Update from installing drivers for your AMD Radeon graphics using system properties. And how we do this is um, on Windows 10 and Windows 11, you just head to your search and do a search for change device installation settings. So I'll say that again, it's change device installation settings. And then you just click on that and here you'll get device installation settings. And it says, do you want to automatically download manufacturers, apps and custom icons available for your devices? And obviously the default is yes, recommended. You change that to no. And um, no, your device might not work as expected. Just ignore that and save the changes. And then that should resolve the issue. And something else you can try. Um, AMD says you need to reinstall the AMD software using the latest available package. So if we head to that, and I'll leave a link to this um, page down below. Um, you can obviously install the AMD software um, using the latest package, which you can find um, from this download location and this page, which um, I'll will leave in the description for quick access and reference. And that's more or less what's happening and some things you can try until a fix is rolled out. And over and above that, um, AMD mentions that for users that prefer to use UWP and or customized drivers for the AMD graphics, uninstall AMD software, um, Adrenaline, Adrenaline Edition through Windows settings, apps and features, and continue to use the OEM customized driver software. And as mentioned, future updates will be provided by the OEM and or a Windows update. And obviously I'll keep my eye on this one. And if a fix and a driver update does roll out, be that from um, Microsoft using um, the Windows update or AMD releasing a new driver, I will obviously post and let you guys know accordingly. So thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one.